cultivate harmony. There are different ways of living on this planet. One of them, when you go into fighting mode, when you go into conflicting and friction mode, you know, you enter into rivalry and into aggression and into crisis mode and, you know, all the shadow expressions that come into your life, all that is, you know, just a way of living. I'm not going to criticize it or judge it. What I'm giving you here is the possibility to look at life from a different place. And this different place is the idea that you want to cultivate harmony at all times. So being able to be in arguments and in fights, you know, that's one way of living which is precious and it's valuable so sometimes. And the ability that you might have to go back and cultivate harmony systematically in different situations where maybe conflict and friction are not serving you, it's a very powerful thing. So the question that I have for you is, if you want to cultivate harmony and go back to harmony, what are the steps that you would take? What are the conversations you would have with people? How would you engage into life? If you feel like there is a crisis or drama stepping, you know, starting somewhere, <laughs> it's like what do you do? How do you go back to harmony? How do you cultivate that inside of you? This is the question that I want to ask you today. How do you do it? And sometimes it is first by being able to access this harmony and this peace right inside of you. This is my advice for now. Cultivate harmony.